A demand for justice out of Dixon County tonight. It's been one year since a six-month-old baby boy died at the hands of his babysitter. Even though the suspect has been charged, the case has yet to go to trial. News 2's My Owens attended a vigil for the boy and spoke with his parents in this story you'll see only here on News 2. The whole family says they want two things, justice and accountability. And while they say that won't come tonight, they're hoping by coming together and praying, their loss will become a little easier. The it's the type of music that soothes the soul. But mending it was the mission on Wednesday night. It's been hard, for sure. In the small town of Charlotte, you'll find the Dixon County Justice Center, where families come to find closure. And it was on its footsteps where the halls prayed for just that. Police had called me and said that uh, there had been an accident, um, that something was wrong with Lincoln. And we raced to Vanderbilt as fast as we could, only to find out the extent of his injuries were unrecoverable. Lincoln had died in October of 2020. Five days of in the ICU, praying that our son was gonna just hop back up out of the bed and start giggling again. Back in April of this year, Chelsea Smith was charged with felony murder and aggravated child abuse in relation to Lincoln's death. We just kind of want to pray over the courthouse and that everything would go the way the justice would be served, um, the way it should be. Though this past year has been nothing short of difficult, they are constantly reminded of how their son was a beaming light. He was just so happy. I mean, all the time, he was a good baby. I had never seen a baby smile from the time he wakes up to the time he goes to sleep. And that was every day. Now he's remembered with a little help from a bear. He goes everywhere with us. He's, he's essentially our little Lincoln stand-in. Um, stand <laughs> As they honor their smiling little boy. And the family tells me this case was supposed to go to trial this Thursday, but has since been pushed back to August. Reporting in Dixon County, My Owens, News 2. After his death, Lincoln was able to save three lives through organ donation. After the family stay at Vanderbilt Children's Hospital, they are asking others to donate stuffed animals in his honor.